Good evening, everyone. How are you? Happy Monday. Happy beginning of the week. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo están? Hi, teacher. Hi, Karen. How are you? I am fine. Nice. It's good to see you. Happy to see you. Hi, how are you, Jonathan? How are Hi, you? Teacher. Good. Hi, Wilber. Hi, teacher. Hi. Espero que hayan tenido un feliz fin de semana, que lo hayan pasado bien y que hayan recargado baterías. Estamos en la recta final, amiguitos. Tres clases más nos quedan. Bueno, después de ahora dos. Así que hay que ponerle todo el empeño que nos quede, porque con esto nos vamos ya y despedimos el año, ¿no? Así que a ustedes les va a quedar eso aquí. En el último mes empezaron al menos una de sus metas, ¿no? Así que vamos con todo. So. We were talking before we start, de hecho, vamos a revisar plataforma. Eh, sábado en la mañana actualicé notas y les mandé el, eh, lo que les puse en el, en el grupo de WhatsApp. Eh, ahora en la noche estaría actualizando una vez más y en la última actualización miércoles después de la clase, que ya todo tendría que estar completo. Así que solo como recordatorio. Ok, Ramón, cuando llegue a su casa nos deja saber y puede participar. Eh, así que solo como recordatorio, los que están pendientes con la plataforma, pues todavía tienen tiempo. Por eso. Ok, so let's see. Do you remember? ¿Se acuerdan que estábamos haciendo la semana pasada, viernes? ¿Qué temas estuvimos viendo? Veamos. Preposition. Exactly. Veníamos de hablar de prepositions of time. In, on, at, como prepositions of time. Veníamos de hablar de eso y luego iniciamos hablando de prepositions of place. ¿Ok? And we have an exercise in here. Vamos a hacer un pequeño... Um, Dígame. There is a... There a... Exactly. Y luego terminamos hablando el viernes con de, there is y there are y quantifiers. There is a, there are, some, etc. Okay, so we're gonna do an exercise right now. So you're going to use preposition in, on, in front of, above, under, between, behind, or next to. Para determinar a dónde está el gato o el ratón. Okay, so we have three, six, nine, twelve. Tenemos doce más, así que tenemos doce para participar, okay? Ana Orellana dice estar de oyente por el momento. De acuerdo, Ana, cuando llegue a su casa nos deja saber para que pueda participar. All right. So tenemos en total 12. Vamos a darle dos a cada uno para que sean seis participantes. Ok. Cada uno de ustedes puede hacer, por ejemplo, the cat is. Usted escoge la proposición. The ball. Oh, ok. The mouse is. Usted dice la proposición. The chase. Right. So we're, we're going to need six participants. So vamos seis participantes. Levantemos la manita para asignarlos. Number one, Dolores, usted tiene los primeros dos. Eh, Juliana, usted tiene este y el de abajo. Julio, usted tiene los dos, de las, los dos últimos de la segunda línea. Wilbur, usted tiene los primeros dos de la tercera línea. Eh, Karen, usted tiene este y este. Este de acá y este. Y Tatiana tiene los últimos dos. Ok. Iniciamos. Dolores. The cat is on the ball. Uh -huh, correct. The mouse is in front of the cheese. Correct. Dolores. Thank you. Oh, that's not it. Number two. Juliana, please. The cat is next to. Uh -uh. Mm, pan, entonces. No, está en medio, ¿ve? ¿eh? Está en medio de dos. Oh, ¿Cuál es, teacher? Ah, ya, ya, ya. Between. Ok. The cat is between. ¿Between qué? Next to. No. Between, ¿qué va a usar? Between. The balls. The balls. Uh -huh. En medio de las pelotas. Between the balls. Correct. Y la de la Este. La S. Ok. Uh -huh. The cat is next to. Uh -huh. Este sí es next to. Este sí es next to. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Next to, ¿qué, okay, Juliana? 
la oración completa. The cat is next to the ball. The ball. Correct. Thank you. Number three, please. Okay. Uh, the, the mouse is on the cheese. Mm -hmm. uh, the cat is under the ball. Correct. Thank you. Number four. The mouse is about. Mm, this is adentro. Yeah, uh, sería the, the mouse in. Mm -hmm. Is in. Under. The mouse is in. Is it under? No, sin under. Solo in. The mouse is in. Adentro de qué está? Uh, it is cheese. Mm -hmm. The mouse is in the cheese. Está adentro del queso. Number. La, la segunda. Por. They. They got. Uh, in front of the mm -mm. ball. Está arriba sin hacer contacto físico. ¿Cómo es? ¿Cuál es eso? About, perdón. Mm -hmm. Entonces. The cat is about mm -hmm. the ball. About the ball. Correct. Like that. Thank you. Number five, please. The cat is between the sheets. Este no es el cat, este es el mouse. <laughs> Ay, perdón. <laughs> the mouse is between the sheets. Correct. The mouse is under the sheets. Exactly. Thank you. And last one, number six. The mouse is behind the sheets. Mm -hmm. The cat is in front of the ball. Correct. Very good, guys. You're using the prepositions of place correctly. Okay, Jonathan, también nos deja saber cuando llegue para participar, por favor. Okay, so moving forward, we're going to answer these questions. Okay, this is going to be personal. Estas son individuales. La van a contestar con su información. Okay, for example, how often do you exercise? Mm, I exercise like three times a week. Um, how often does your sister do exercise? If you don't have a sister, pueden inventar. La idea es que respondan. Um, my, sister, my sister does exercise every day in the morning or every morning, right? Y así van con cada una de las preguntas que están ahí. This is going to be individual, all right? So I'm going to give you guys 10 minutes. Le voy a dar 10 minutos para que les contesten con su información. Si hay preguntas como your sister, your mother, o algo así, usted improvise. La idea es que pueda contestar. Right? Okay, so it's going to be 8 y 11 a las 20. Podemos iniciar. Okay? You have 10 minutes. Estos son individuales para que las responda. Traten de hacer oraciones largas como respuesta. Tanta información como se puede. Okay?
If you already finished, you can also raise your hand. Los que vayan terminando de contestarlas, también pueden ir levantando la manita y vamos iniciando con ustedes. Si no, igual tienen hasta las 20. <coughs> Okay, we're going to begin with Dolores. Dolores, please go ahead. Okay. Um, how often do you do you do exercise? I do exercise once a month. Okay. How often does your sister do exercise? My sister does exercise. Exercise every day. Okay. Next block. Next block. Siguiente bloque. Okay. Do you enjoy cooking? Co cooking. 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 Mm -hmm. Cooking. Okay. No, I don't enjoy cooking. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> okay. How often do you cook? I cook rarely. 
All right. What about your mother? Does she like to cook? Yes, my mother enjoys cooks, but nice. she, she cooks once a day. All right. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Next block. Do you go out with your friend? Yes, I go out with my friend the last week. Mm, last week es pasado, pero puede decir every week. Ah, uh, every week, okay. Mm -hmm. Every, yeah, sería every month. Okay, every month. Every month, uh-huh. Okay, how often do you go out with your friend? I go out with my friends every month. We go, uh -huh. uh, okay, can I wait? Where do you go? We go to the restaurant, the mountain, or the beach. Good. <laughs> Next one, okay. please. Okay. Do you use a computer a lot? Yes, I use computer a lot. Uh, does your sister use a computer a lot? No, my sister does not use her computer a lot. Do you like to travel? Yes, I like to travel. Mm -hmm. Does your brother like to travel? Yes, my brother likes likes to travel. All right. Does your best friend like to travel? I don't know, but I <laughs> yes. <laughs> Very good, huh? <laughs> okay. And how many languages does your sister speak? My sister speaks two languages, English and Spanish. How many languages does your brother speak? Only one, Spanish. All right. <laughs> Very good. Mm -hmm. La idea con, esta, con estas preguntas es que ustedes sepan, si se fijan, ahí hay yes or no questions, information questions, verb to be, um, action verbs, etc. right? So the idea, the idea is that you can use everything, right? La idea es que ustedes pueden contestarlas todas y de ahí se van midiendo ustedes qué tal están. Muy buen trabajo mencionando las S en los verbos cuando, cuando menciona tercera persona, dolores afirmativos, very good. He speaks, right? So like that, very good. Vamos a escuchar ahora a Julio Paz, por favor. Puede iniciar. Ahorita dice, déjenme acomodar esto acá, que he movido estas cosas. Ok, para la primera interrogante, eh, I do exercise from Monday to Friday. All right. Ah, my sister uh, does not exercise at the gym. She prefers out to run. Ok. La siguiente, I love cook especially if it's Mexican food. Luego, I cook on Saturday in the afternoon. All right. Luego, yes, my mother loves to cook. But love or love? Oh, love. Love? Love. Yes, my mother loves to cook, uh, but she actually <coughs> don't cook more. Okay, that's it. Uh, ¿Ah? Doesn't ah, doesn't. Me. Cierto, cierto. Gracias, uh -huh. teacher. Ok. Uh, la siguiente. Yes, I go out with my friends. Y la siguiente es, usually on Friday. Salimos normalmente en viernes. Ok. ¿Y a dónde vamos? Uh, we go out to drink. Uh, no, no, to drink. To drink. Uh -huh. Or to eat. To eat. All right. Luego, yes. I use a computer a lot. Y luego la siguiente de mi hermana. No, uh -huh. my sister doesn't use, use a computer. Uh -huh. Doesn't use, luego, porque ya tiene el doesn't. Ahí use. no le pones. Sí, sí, ya uh -huh. está antes el, 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 el auxiliar, auxiliar, perdón. Exacto. Ajá. Uh, siguiente, yes, I love to travel. Eh, luego sigue, eh, yes, my brother loves to travel. Uh -huh. He comes to El Salvador three times a year. Okay. Luego, uh, no, my best friend doesn't like to travel. 
Correct. Luego, my sister only speaks Spanish. Luego, uh, speaks mm -hmm. Spanish. Yeah. Luego, my brother, my brother speaks Spanish and English. Very Enough. good. Perfect. Julia, well answered. Thank you. All right, let's see who's next. ¿Quién sigue? Veamos. Levanten la mano para irnos asignando, por favor. Very good job, Dolores and Julio, so far. Voy a esperar a que levanten las manos para darles la palabra para que puedan participar. Recuerden que todos tienen que mencionar, contestar estas respuestas. La idea es que ustedes se vayan midiendo acá. No veo las manos. What is happening? Ok, entonces empezamos a llamar. ¿Están listos? Porque quien le pida tiene que estar presentando. Por favor. Vamos con Hayden, please. Yeah, buenas noches. Buenas noches, Hayden. <laughs> How often do you exercise? I, I do exercise. Mm -hmm. Once a week, okay. I run a little bit. Okay. Uh, how often does your sister do exercise? Uh, she, she, oh, ¿cómo se dice? how does your sister do exercise? She, no. Does? She doesn't. She doesn't. Huh? Okay. Uh -huh. She doesn't never exercise with my sister. Okay, she doesn't do exercise or she never exercises. Cualquiera de las dos. Ah, cualquiera de las dos se puede usar. Uh -huh. Porque never ya es negativo. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces sería she never. Uh -huh. She never exercises. She exercise with my sister. Okay. Uh -huh. Very good. Next. Do you enjoy cooking? No, I don't enjoy cooking. I enjoy <laughs> cleaning my house. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How often do you cook? En ese caso, como no me gusta, pues, cada cuánto te... Ah, sí, I almost mm -hmm. never cook at home. All right. Uh, what about your mother? Does she like to cook? Yes, she likes to cook for the family. Perfect. Uh, do you go out with your friends? Yes, I go out with, with my friends. How often do you go out with your friends? I sometimes go out with my friends. Uh, mm -hmm. Where do you go? Uh, we are going to eat together. Okay. Uh, do you use a computer a lot? Yes, I do use a computer a lot. Does your sister use a computer a lot? No, she doesn't use a computer a lot. Um, do you like to travel? Yes, I like to travel. Does your brother like to travel? Yes, my brother likes to travel. Uh, does your best friend like to travel? Yes, my best friend likes to travel. Mm -hmm. uh, how many languages does your sister speak? My sister speaks two languages, Spanish and English. All right. How many languages does your brother, brother speak? Mm -hmm. No, I don't have brother speak language. Very good. Thank you, Hayden. Well answered. Todas estuvieron super bien contestadas. Thank you. Very good job. All right, let's see. Vamos entonces con Claudia. Claudia Chita, la escuchamos. How often do you exercise? Um, I not exercise. ¿Cómo sería el negativo entonces? Usando el auxiliar. I does not. I do not. I do not. Exercise. Mm -hmm. Next. How how often do your sister do exercise? My sister does not uh, exercise. All right. Next. Do you enjoy cooking? Um. Disfruta cocinar. Do you enjoy cooking? Um. Yes. I love cooking. All right. How often do you cook? Uh, I do cooking I every cook. day. I cook every day. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, what about your, bro your, your mother? Does she like to cook? Yes. About you, my mother? Uh, I like cook. Sí, I like. My mother likes to cook. My mother likes to cook. Mm -hmm. Do you go out with your friends? Yes, I go out with my friends. Good. Uh -huh. How after uh, do you go with your friends? Um, I often uh, my friends with you. How often is que tan seguido? Every Monday, every Saturday, once a week. Ay, <laughs> los meses. Ah, uh, uh, pues, puedo decir almost never, casi nunca. Y dice, I almost never go out with I, my friends. I almost never uh, out with my friends. All right, next. Where you go? Uh -huh. um, go. Como no sale casi, realmente no, no tiene, no puede contestar esa. Sí, pasa a la siguiente. Uh -huh. Do you use computer a lot? Yes, I am use computer a lot. Sin el am. Yes, uh, I use a computer a lot. Correct, next. Does your sister uh, use compu a computer a lot? Yes, my sister uh, use computer a lot. Uses. Uses. Mm -hmm. Computer a lot. Yeah. Do you like uh, to travel? Yes. I like to, uh, like to travel. Very good. Next. Your, uh, does your brother like to travel? Yes. My brother like to travel. Okay. Next. Does, you, does your, uh, your best friends like to travel? Yes. My best friends likes to travel. Good. How many languages do your sister speak? My sister language. My sister uh, speaks. My sister speak two languages. Okay. Um, English or Spanish. How many languages do your brother speak? Uh, my brother use speak. Uh, language speak. One language, Spanish. All right. Very good, Claudia. Thank you. Good job. Ahora escuchamos a Karen Velázquez, por favor. How often do you do exercise? No, I don't exercise. <laughs> okay. Honestly. <laughs> <laughs> how often do no how often does your sister do exercise my brother and me don't answer <laughs> okay next um do you enjoy co cooking yes I enjoy like cooking. enjoy enjoy do you enjoy cooking? Yes, I like cooking. Mm -hmm. um, how often do you cook? Um, I cook at night. All right. What about your mother? Do she like to cook? Uh, yeah, yes, I go with my... Uh, yes, yes. Can, can this one? Uh -huh. Yes, she likes to cook. All right, good. Do you go out with your friends? Uh, yes, I go out with my friends. Um, how often do you go, go out with your friends? And uh, it's not much with my friends. Good. Uh -huh. uh, well, where do you go? Tomorrow to the house. Okay. Do, do you do you use a do computer? You do you use a computer 
a lot. Yes, I watch the computer a lot. Mm -hmm. uh, does, does your sister use a computer a lot? Uh, no, my brother does. Doesn't. My brother does, doesn't see the computer much. Okay. Um, do you like to travel? Yes, like to travel. <laughs> yes, I like to travel. Does your yes, I like to travel. Mm -hmm. uh, does does your brother like to travel? Yes, my brother likes to travel. Does mm -hmm. your best friend to does your does your best friend like to travel? Uh, yes, my friend likes to travel. Um, how many languages does your sister speak? Um, my brother speaks English. All right. How many languages does your brother speak? My brother speaks a language. One language. One. Mm -hmm. Very good, mm -hmm. Karen. Very well answered. Thank you. <laughs> Very good job. All right, let's see. Antes de seguir, los demás que faltan, levanten la mano, por favor, para que los pueda ver y les pueda dar participación. Um, en lo que ustedes levanten la mano, todos tienen que participar. Este no es voluntario, es obligación. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Les voy a pasar asistencia, denme un minuto. En lo que carga la lista, por favor, antes de que se me olvide. Ok, we're in class number 18. Estamos en la clase número 18. Y es lunes 19 de diciembre. Estamos con Ana Luz. Ana Luz. Ana Ruth Orellana. <risa> Present. <risa> Lo siento. Brenda Lisette Fuentes. Yeah. Thank you. Claudia Patricia Chita. Present. Thank you. Daisy Tatiana Cruz. Thank you. Thank you. Dolores de los Ángeles Salinas. Ernesto, thank you. Ernesto René Blanco. Present. Thank you. Juliana María Amaya. Present. Thank you. Helen Saraí Valle. Present. Thank you. Jonathan Eduardo Orantes. José Javier Valle. Present, Miss. Thank you. Julio Aristides Paz. Present teacher. Present. Thank you. Karen Emperatriz Velázquez. Present. Thank you. Nilsa Alejandra Sánchez. Ramón Mauricio Díaz. Present. Thank you. Raúl Arturo Lazo. Chelsea Marjorie Guardado. I'm here. Thank you. Wilber Antonio Romero. Present teacher. Thank you. Genesis Patricia. Freddy Franklin Turcios. Santos Gonzalo Hernández. Wendy Yamilet Umaña. Presente. Thank you. And Jose David Gaitán. Okay. Present. Thank you. All right, let's continue then. Veamos los que están pendientes de participar. Levanten la mano, por favor. Vamos con Chelsea Guardado, por favor. Le escuchamos, Chelsea. Solo déjeme poner de nuevo en pantalla la, la presentación. Un momento. Uy, ¿qué se hizo? Un minuto. De. Ahora, Chelsea, por favor. How often do you do exercise? I try to do exercise once a week. How often do we, does your sister do exercise? My sister doesn't like to do exercise, but she tries two or three times a month. 
Do you enjoy cooking? I enjoy cooking, but not all the food. How often do you cook? I cook every day. What about your mother? Does she like to cook? My mother doesn't like to cook, especially the food that take a long time. A long time. Do you go out with your friends? Yes, if I have time, I go out with my friends. Um, how often do you go out with your friends? I go out with my friends like once or three times a year. Okay. And where do you go? I go to eat something. Mm -hmm. Or we go to eat something. Okay. And do you use do you use a computer a lot? Yes, I use the computer a lot. Does your sister use a computer a lot? No, she doesn't use the computer a lot. Do you like to travel? Yes, I like to travel. Does your brother like to travel? Yes, my brother likes to travel. Does your best friend like to travel? Yes, they like to travel. How many languages does your sister speak? My sister speaks one language. How many languages does your brother speak? My brother speaks one language. Very good. Thank you, Chelsea. Vamos con Tatiana Cruz, por favor. How often do you exercise? No, I don't exercise. Who often does your sister do exercise? Yes, does exercise always. Do you enjoy cooking? No, I don't enjoy cooking. Who often do you cook? No, I don't, never cook. Sí, what never, about? no, I don't cook. No, I don't? Cook. Al final, never. No se ocupa el never. El never ya es negativo, como si lo dijéramos dos veces. Entonces, usted puede decir, no, I never cook, o puede decir, no, I don't cook. Pero los dos juntos no. No, no, I never cook. Ok. Eh, what, a, what about your mother? Do, does she like to cook? Yes, she does like to cook. Do you go out with your friends? Yes, I do. We go out the beach. All right. Ahí ya contestó no. esas tres, de hecho. <ríe> Sobre el jabón, le falta. La última ya la contestó. Sí, después me percaté que ya la había contestado. Pero está muy bien. Often, <ríe> how often do you go out with your friends? I go out the week in the night. In night. Ok. We, where do you go? I go the beach. To the beach. I go to the beach. To. Okay. I go to the beach. Mm -hmm. Do you use a computer a lot? Yes, I do. I use a computer in the world. Okay. Does your sister use a computer a lot? No, she doesn't use a computer a lot. Do you like to travel? Yes, I do like to travel. Yes, I do, or yes, I like to travel. Yes, I like to travel. Okay. Yes, I like to travel. Mm -hmm. Does your brother like to travel? Yes, he does like so much to travel. Ahí igual, no ocupa el auxiliar para afirmativo, ¿se acuerda? Solo le agrega la S. He likes to travel. Okay. Does your best friend like to travel? Yes, she likes to travel for the work. Correct. How many language language does your sister speak? She does. Ah, no, entonces ahí es igual, ¿verdad? She uh -huh. speaks uh -huh. two languages. Okay. How many languages? Does your brother speak? 
He speaks three languages. Very good, Tatiana, thank you. And Brenda, please. How often do you do exercise? I I'm never do exercise. How often does your sister do exercise? Um, she, she doesn't exercise. Mm -hmm. Do you enjoy cooking? No, I don't. I, I do not enjoy cooking. All right. How often do you cook? I cook on weekends at dinner. What about your mother? Does she like to cook? Yes, she does. She likes to cook a lot. Okay. Do you go out with your friends? Yes, I do. I go out with my friends on weekends. How often do you go out with your friends? I go out with my friends on weekends at night. Where do you go? Um, we go to eat and dance. All right. Do you use a computer a lot? Yes, I do. I use a computer a lot every day. Mm -hmm. Does your sister use a computer a lot? A lot? Yes, she does. She use a computer a lot. Okay. Do you like to travel? Yes, I do. I like to travel a lot. Mm -hmm. Does your brother like to travel? Yes, he does. He likes to travel when he has free time. Okay. Does your best friend like to travel? Yes, she does. She likes to travel a lot. How many languages does your sister speak? Um, she speaks just one language. How many languages does your brother speak? And he does speak just one language. All right, very good, Brenda. And thank you everyone who participated. You did it right. Este tipo de ejercicio les ayuda a ustedes a llevar seguimiento de las estructuras que ya conocen. Y nos ayuda a ver qué parte hay que reforzar o qué parte solo hay que poner un poquito más de atención, por ejemplo, ¿right? Los que participaron hasta ahorita tienen la certeza que este tema, esto, esto ya lo manejan, así que muy bien, excelente trabajo. Los que no participaron todavía estamos pendientes de ver realmente si hay algo que pulir o no. Más adelante tal vez con otras actividades pueden revisar, ¿all right? So, moving forward, we have a conversation in here. I'm going to need two people, Jack and Mrs. Day. Two volunteers. Halem, you're going to read Jack. And Dolores, you're going to read Mrs. Day. Please. Excuse me. I'm your new, new neighbor, Jack. Are you smoking? Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some um, in the street. Oh, okay. and is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. Bye. Uh, by the way, there is a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? It's a pila, señora. Very good job, Dolores. Helen, thank you. We need two more volunteers. Ocupamos dos voluntarios más. Vamos a leer la misma conversación. Claudia, you are going to be Jack, and Brenda, you are going to be Mrs. Day. Let's begin, please. En la última ronda, perdón. Perdón que le interrumpa. La última ronda la va a hacer Julio y Wilber. Julio Jack y Mrs. Day Wilber. La tercera ronda. Ok, iniciamos, Claudia. Excuse me. I'm your new uh, neighbor. 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 Jack, I, who, I use moving in. Oh, yes. 
I am looking for a grocery store. Are they any ro around her? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near her? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there is a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop. Thank you. Y la última ronda vamos con Wilber y Julio, por favor. Ok, ahorita, ahorita. Espérame. Ahorita. Ok. Uh, excuse me. I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around, around, no, perdón, any around here? Yes, they are some on Pine Stream. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I did there one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the white day barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop. Perfect. Yes. Very good. Thank you. All right. So take pay attention to that conversation. We're using some of the topic that we were seeing. So you're going to work in groups or with partners and you're going to create a conversation like the previous one using there is, there are, or yeah, is there and are there, okay? Vamos a hacer tanto los afirmativos como las preguntas. There is, there are, or is there, or are there, right? So let me just open the breakout rooms. Te voy a abrir la sala, give me one moment. Ok, van a estar tres participantes por sala, de dos a tres cada uno. Van a tener diez minutos inicialmente para hacer la conversación. Pueden tomar esa anterior como base. La de ustedes tiene que ser un poco más larga porque van a tener más tiempo. Así que la de ustedes tiene que ser más larga con más información. El requisito es que ocupen there is, there are, o are there, o is there. Y dan ubicaciones, right? So you're going to have ten minutes. Las salas están abiertas a partir de este momento. Pueden ingresar. Please, me ayuda. No me debo ingresar. Please. David, vaya, permítame. Sí. Lo voy a mover a otra sala. No vaya a aceptar todavía, David. Ya le voy a avisar. Ahora. Ya puede ingresar. No diga el du. Dígame, hay que pedir una asistencia. Teacher, eh, sorry, eh, entré de una vez a la sala y no presté atención a lo que vamos a, a hacer. Es una conversación tal? como la que acaban de leer. Una conversación con there is, there are, y las preguntas, is there, are there, cosas de dar, para dar ubicación. Is there a dollar city in here? Uh, yes, there is one in this and this place, y así, ¿ok? Are there any ah. banks in this place? Ah, no, there are not, but there are here and here, okay? 
La idea es que ocupen is there, are there, y there is, there are. En la conversación para dar ubicación. ¿Ok? Ok. Uh -huh. La Gracias. conversación que sea un poquito más larga que la que ustedes acaban de practicar. Esa era solo un ejemplo, una muestra, y la de ustedes tiene que ser un poco más larga. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. All right. Muy bien, gracias. Los dejo entonces. All right. uh -huh. Gracias.
Okay, ahora que estamos todos de regreso, let me check with you guys. Did you finish the assignment or do you need more time? Need more time, more time please. All right, perfect. Son las 9 y 7, le voy a dar hasta las 8 y 15, okay? Las salas están abiertas ahorita, pueden ingresar de nuevo. David, ¿en qué sala estaba usted? ¿Con quién? Con Tatiana estaba Miss. Vaya, ahorita.
Okay, now that we're back to the main session, we're going to begin. We're going to start with room number one. Tenemos a David Gaitán y Tatiana Cruz. Los escuchamos. De entrada a mí. Ahí vamos. Solo. <laughs> eh, eh, miss, excuse me, I am looking for Starbucks. Le faltó. Are there any around here? Bueno. Yes, there are some on mold. Okay, thank you. And is there a um, jean her? I think there is a one uh, behind Sinepolis. Okay. Uh, uh, will uh, there buy a, a, pal, a plug to have lunch in the mall? Yes, there are many restaurants here. Okay, thank you, Miss. Bye. Very good. Thank you. Si era exactamente lo que se le pidió, la conversación estuvo corta, pero la verdad es que entregaron lo que se pidió. There is, there are, are there, is there. So very good job. Room number one, David and Tatiana, muy buen trabajo. Thank you. Let's go with room number two. Vamos a escuchar a Claudia, René y Chelsea, por favor. Hi, Chelsea. Hi, René. How are you? No sé si están o no están. René, Chelsea. René. Hi, Claudia. Hi, Chelsea. Very good. How, Claudia? How, René? I'm fine. And how's your new house? It's a big. It's a great. It's big. Is it big, Claudia? You have? Yes. yes, there are uh, three bedrooms and two bathrooms. There is also a big yard and a swimming pool. Wow, do you have enough furniture? We bought some new fur furniture. There is a new sofa in the living room. We bought a new table and child for the drink room, a new a new dress dresser for the bedroom. When do you be inviting us to your house? Come at 2 p.m. for coffee. Okay, so we'll we will go. Finish. Okay. Very good. Room number two. Thank you. So like estamos pendientes la próxima para que sus compañeros no se queden esperando a que ustedes le contesten, right? Other than that, fuera de eso, muy bien están las estructuras que se les pidieron. Thank you. Room number two. Escuchamos ahora solo tres. Tenemos a Dolores eh, y Karen Velázquez. Las escuchamos, ladies. Hi, Dolores. Excuse me, is there a pharmacy? Hi, Karen. Yes, just there is one from on the gym. And it is far from here? No, it's not. Go straight and cross to the left. Then in front of, in front of the gym, there is a pharmacy. Oh, thank you for your help. And do you know where there is a cafeteria? Yes, I do. There is a cafeteria next to the pharmacy. Okay, thank you, Dolores. You're welcome, Karen. Very good job, ladies. Very conversational, very fluent, and also you use the structure que se estaba buscando. So, muy buen trabajo, Sala 3. Ladies, thank you. Vamos a escuchar a sala 5. Tenemos a Haylen, Julio y Wilber, por favor. All right. Hi, Julio. Eh, nice to meet you. Eh, 
help me please. Uh, where where is where is the hospital? Hi Wilbert. Uh, the hospital is in the downtown next to the little Caesar behind to Central Park. Hello, excuse me. I'm new in town. I am Aileen. Could you tell me where is the Salvador del Mundo? Hi, Helen. Nice to meet you. Uh, El Salvador del Mundo is in from of A4CC. Thank you. So is it near the near La Campana? Yes, at Campana. Thank you for your help. I see you later, Julio y Helen. Thank you. Uh, Bye. Do you know friends? Uh, do you know friends? Uh, there is a good place to talk next time. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you too much. Very good job. From number five, very good job. It was very fluent, very conversational, and also you used the structures that we're looking for. So les felicito también from number five. Muy buen trabajo. Y vamos a escuchar por último a Brenda y a Wendy Omanda. ¿Qué hay después? Good morning. Sorry, I'm new to the this city and I need to get to City Hall. Do you know where it's located? And what is your name? My name is Wendy. Nice to meet you. And what is your name? And and Tay City. And Tay City Hall is true. The city wall in General Cabana Avenue and from of the park. Thank you so much, Wendy. I'm Brenda. Nice to meet you too. And is it a restaurant near here? Of course. It is a restaurant next to the city wall. The restaurant Nais Pollo Campero. Thank you, Wendy. And the last question, is there any bank near here? There are four banks near here. One is the phone on Foya Campero. Another one is the phone on the bus station. And do more banks are on right the corner. Thanks for your help, Wendy. Have a great day. Very Ini. good job, Brenda, Wendy. That was very natural, very conversational, and also very fluent. You said on a structure that you were looking for. So, good job. Thank you very much. Thank you all for participating. Very good job. All right. So now, let's go back to the one more time. Please be ready. Let's go with Ana Ruth Orellana. Present. Thank you, Brenda Lise Fuentes. Here I am. Thank you. Claudia Patricia Chita. Daisy Tatiana Cruz. Dolores de los Ángeles Salinas. Present. Thank you. Ernesto René Blanco. Present. Thank you. Juliana Maria Amaya. Present. Thank you. Helen Saraí Valle. Present. Thank you. Jonathan Eduardo Orantes. Jose Javier Valle, Julio Aristides Paz. Present, present. Thank you. Karen Emperatriz Velázquez. Present, present, me. Thank you. Ramón present. Mauricio Díaz. Thank you. Present. Thank you. Raúl Arturo Lazo. Raúl Arturo Lazo. Chelsea Marjorie Guardado. Here. Thank you. Wilber Antonio Moreno. I am here, teacher. Thank you. Genesis Patricia Fuentes. Freddy Franklin Turcios. Santos Gonzalo Hernández. Wendy Yamilet Umani. Present. And thank you. Present. And Jose David Gaitán. Present, teacher. Thank you. Very good. We're going to continue. Estoy. 
Pero Bien. se me fue el inter un momentito y no pude responder. Claudia. Ok, Claudia, thank you. Yo también right. aquí estoy, perdón. De acuerdo, thank you. Vamos entonces a continuar. We have the exercise on page 40. All right, it says complete the location of each item using the correct preposition of place. Van a escoger, son seis las que acá. Ustedes van a escoger qué preposición ocupan. In, on, or at. Ok, por cada uno de esos ustedes escogen cuál de las preposiciones van a usar del lugar. Ok, para esto tienen cuatro minutos porque solo van a colocar una preposición. ¿vale? Son las 27 a las 31 iniciales. Sí. Ahí está terminando este capítulo. Día me voy a descansar de que me hable así. Mi amor, yo que le dije. ¿Qué le dije? ¿Por qué le dije que a la tía? Claudia, iniciamos con usted, por favor. Number one. I work in the bank that is uh, on First Avenue, Avenue and various Street. Correct. I work in the bank that is on First Avenue and various Street. Very good. Number two, Julio. Uh, number two. Okay. Uh, their factory is located in La Libertad. Exactly. Their factory is located in La Libertad. Very good. Next, number three, do we have volunteers? Vamos cuatro voluntarios para recibir las últimas cuatro. Levanten la mano, porfa, para asignárselas. Ramón, number three. We see you at training room or at the cafeteria. Okay, ahí sería in the training room or at the cafeteria. Okay, in the training room porque es adentro del cuarto de entrenamiento o en la cafetería que es amplio, right? Number four, please. Let's continue. We need a volunteer for number four. Hayden, please, number four. Anna works in the company that is in town. That is in town, exactly. Number five, Brenda, please. My relatives go to the mall. That is on Roosevelt Street. Perfect, that is correct. That is on Roosevelt Street, very good. And number six, we need one more volunteer for number six, let's see. Just this one, vamos un voluntario más. Julio, please. Uh, tell him that we are uh, at the meeting room with everybody. Exactly. I know you must have right? Yes, yeah, the 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 position the mm -hmm. Ellos solo yeah. le pusieron ahí. Very good, Julio. Thank you. All right. 
for the exercise number six, you have to create your own map with your workplace on it and the places, buildings, and others that surround it. Show and explain your map to other partners. Van a entrar a la sala nuevamente y van a trabajar en equipo. Van a crear un mapa, dibujitos, ahí algo sencillo que pueden hacer, que puedan compartir en pantalla después, ¿ok? O pueden usar una imagen de internet de un mapa, de un croquis, ¿verdad? Donde esté. Y ustedes pueden decir, ok, this is my, this is my work. Okay, aquí está mi trabajo. Y dice que vamos a hablar de lugares que hay alrededor, edificios, otras cosas que están alrededor. Y mostrando el mapa, un ejemplo. Imaginen que está el mapa. Yo lo empecé. Ok, I work at Inglés Corporativo. Inglés Corporativo is in Escalón. Ok, it's in Escalón. And there is a big, big, there is a big roundabout, like three three blocks away from the academy, okay? Hay un gran redondel como a tres bloques, como tres cuadras de la academy, okay? There is a big roundabout of three blocks from the academy. There are a lot of offices next to the office, next to the academy. Hay bastantes oficinas a la parte de la academy, okay? Entonces aquí les voy a ir mostrando yo un, un dibujo, right? Aquí está la academia, eso está aquí a la par, there is, there are, Pueden usar las preposiciones de lugar, right? Next to, behind, across, from, para describir la ubicación dentro del mapa que ustedes están haciendo. Okay? So this is going to be in groups. We're going to recreate them. Y ya están abiertas las áreas. Van a tener 10 minutos para trabajar. Recuerden que tienen que hacer alguna especie de dibujito o solo ponerle los nombres ahí. Y luego van a explicar ustedes, aquí a la par está esto, aquí está donde yo trabajo, arriba, atrás, hay esto y esto y esto, ¿ok? Vamos a ocupar there is, there are y preposición de lugar. Tienen 10 minutos para esto, ¿ok? Pueden ingresar a la sala hacia ahora. Me volvió a dar el mismo problema, Miss. Please, ayuda. Voy. ¿Con quién estaba, David? En la sala 1, ¿verdad? Deme un minuto. No voy a saltar todavía, ya lo digo. Ahora, David.
Miss podría darnos más tiempo. Vamos a esperar a que regresen todos a la sala. All right, now that we're all here, ya que estamos todos acá, let me check with you guys. Do you need more time to finish the activity? Yes, Miss, please. Yes, please. Please. Okay. All right, entonces las salas están abiertas a partir de este momento. Y a las y 50 vamos a iniciar. Okay, you have six minutes. Pueden ingresar ahora. Hola, mis. Se volvieron a conectar, pero a mí no me... O oh, no sé, no sé qué pasó. Tatiana. Sí. Vaya, le voy a mover. Todavía no, no ingresé, ya le voy a decir. Ahora puede ingresar, Tatiana. Ahí está la vida esperándola. Sí, gracias. Uh -huh.
All right, now that we're all back in the main session, we're going to begin. Let's hear room number one. Tenemos a Tatiana y a David Faitán. Nos escuchamos, por favor. Ok, se vamos a compartir pantalla. Ok. Dice que no puede compartir. No puede comenzar a compartir pantalla mientras otro participante está compartiendo. Stop sharing. Ahora puede. Ok. Hoy sí. Okay. The pier is located in the municipality of La Unión on the 7th Street East. Uh, the book is agented uh, to the uh, former in this facility in front of the government center. A still site of the Jetty de Coquitos. Solamente. Okay. Um, no ocuparon there is, there are, para mencionar alguna cosa que estuviera aledaña. Eh, de ahí, sí, yo sí. Mm, all right. <laughs> that was too short. Ya les había mencionado en la actividad anterior que era muy corta la primera actividad. Entonces, tienen que haberme compensado en esta, pero lo vamos a dejar así. Thank you, room number one. Um, utilizaron al menos lo de las proposiciones, que está muy bien. La idea, la idea es que ustedes ocupen hagan cosas más largas para poder practicar más. Um, en la vida real, cuando conversamos, no vamos a hacer como palabritas, hacemos conversaciones largas, ¿ok? Así que solo para que tengan en cuenta, para que puedan practicar más. All right. Thank you. Very good job. Muy buen trabajo utilizando las proposiciones. Eso sí. Thank you. Vamos a escuchar a la sala 2. Room number 2. Tenemos a Brenda y a Wendy Umay. Escuchamos, por favor. Sí, yo lo que nosotros hicimos la conversación similar a la anterior. Ojalá esté bien. Ok. Sí, mamá. mamá. Viste cómo arregló papá. Viste cómo arregló papá. Excuse me, Wendy. Do you know where is the bank? Oh, Brenda. The bank is next to the post office in the front of hospital. And Brenda, do you come where is the pharmacy? Oh, sure, Wendy. The pharmacy is between cinema and the cafe. That's great. Thank you, Brenda. And is there a um, supermarket here? Mm, yes, Wendy. Go straight and the supermarket is in front of the church and the hospital. Thank you, Brenda. And they love a one where is the gas station? Mm, go straight and then turn right. The gas station is in front of the stadium. Thank you, Rinda. See you soon. Thank Very you, good, Wendy. Very good. Room number two. The design propositions. There is, there are, are there is, there is. Very good. Completaron toda la asignación. Thank you. Muy buen trabajo. Let's hear room number three right now. Vamos a escuchar a Ana, René y Chelsea, por favor. Permítame. Quiero ver si puedo compartir pantalla. Porque soy del celular. Este, quiero ver... No, no me deja. Puede compartirlo no. como foto. Ah, ok. <risa> Solo que no sé dónde está. <risa> A ver, galería. Ok, sería esta, sería esta. Ahora sí se ve, ¿verdad? 
Sí, se ve, se veía porque yeah. me dio... Okay. Ay, ahora sí. Ok, Chelsea. Chelsea. Sí. The, the word is... Bebe, bebe mundo. Ana. Hola. Se quitó. Ahorita voy, ahorita voy, que no sé qué le pasa. Quiero ver, sería galería. Acá, ahí está. Ok, va a iniciar de nuevo, sale atrás, Ana, René, Chelsea, por, porque no, no, se, no se escuchó bien la primera vez. Bueno. The world is Bebemundo. It is located on Los Héroes Boulevard. On the left side is the Pizza Hut. On the right is Buffalo Wings and Acro the Street, creo que si se dice enfrente, is Chicken Campero. Y eso fue todo lo que hicimos. Mm, ok. <laughs> That was really short. No me utilizaron. There is, there are, are there, is there. Así que lo vamos a dejar así, pero sí, siempre recuerden, si tienen dudas de qué es lo que se va a hacer, tienen que pedir asistencia. Y yo con todo gusto entro a sus salas y les ayudo, ¿de acuerdo? Um, let's go with room number four. Dolores Salinas um, y Helen Bayer, please. Ok. ¿Pueden ver la foto? Sí. Sí. Sí, todos. Ok, okay. Yes. gracias. Gracias. There is a map uh, in, the, in the map. You can see there are a library and a school uh, and ha a house, a supermarket. There are a stationary store and there are a church in a bank. Helen uh, uh, talk about uh, Where is, uh, there is or what is the direction or the address, the address pardon, uh, <laughs> of the house, Helen. On the map, there is a house located on Hidalgo Avenue between Libertad Street and Colón Street. Across the street, there is a school and uh, back there is a stationary store. On the left side, there is a basketball court. And the right side, we have the bar. Okay. And there are two, uh, the bank. The bank is located in front on the church. It is to the right of the house. And behind of the soccer court. And it, it, um, The bank is between Juarez Avenue and Hidalgo Avenue. Only that, teacher. Very good job. Utilizaban todas las estructuras que se les pidieron. Very good job, Helen and Dolores. It was very fluent and very natural. Thank you. Okay, that's going to be it for tonight. Eso va a ser todo por esta noche. Vamos a pasar la asistencia una vez más. Please be ready. Tenemos a Ana Ruth Orellana. Brenda Lister Fuentes. Here I am. Claudia Patricia Chita. Present. Daisy Tatiana Cruz. I'm here. Dolores de Los Angeles. Present. Ernesto René Blanco. Present. Juliana María Amaya. Present. Haylem Saray. Present. Jonathan Eduardo Orantes. Julio Aristides Pa. Present, me. Present, teacher. 
Karen Emperatriz Velázquez, Ramón Present. Mauricio Díaz, Present. Raúl Arturo Lazo, Chelsea Marjorie Guardado. I'm here. Thank you. Chelsea, usted ya se quedó asesoría, ¿verdad? Sí. Thank you. Wilber Antonio Moreno. Yes, I'm. Thank you. Usted también ya se quedó, ¿verdad, Wilber? Sí, ya. Yeah. Thank you. Genesis Patricia Fuentes, lo tocaría quedarse ahora. Freddy Franklin Turcios. Santos Gonzalo Hernández. Wendy Amilet Umaña. Y José David Gaitán. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, that's going to be it for tonight. I hope to see you all tomorrow. Descansen. Nos veo el día de mañana. Feliz noche. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Bye. Bye. Good night. Take care. Sleep tight. Thank mm -hmm. you.